What's up guys? Hope you're all doing well. We are down here at a piece of land of ours and we're going to do some Dutch oven cooking. Going to cook up some dessert today and uh, we're also going to be taking pictures of our Etsy items to get them posted up there so we'll show you a couple more of those items in this video as well. So come on with us and we'll have a great dessert. What's it called? Uh, apple dump cake. Apple dump cake is what we're going to be cooking. <laughs> great name. All right, Kristen's getting the briquettes lit up there. We're gonna start them up in the grill just so we don't have a big fire on the ground. Uh, I'm not sure about the fire band, if this qualifies or not, so we're just gonna play it safe. And then uh, after they burn down, we'll put them down on here and set the Dutch oven up to heat up. All right, everyone, our fire is getting ready to die down here, so we're gonna take these briquettes out, put them down on the ground, and then we'll go over to Kristen here and kind of walk through the recipes. Once again, we're cooking up apple dump cake. Never had it before, so it should be, uh, sounds pretty good anyway. Well, not really, but the ingredients sound good. <laughs> so yeah, come on and we'll take a look. Hey guys, I also wanted to mention that for this recipe, we uh, lined the Dutch oven up with tin foil to make for an easier clean because it uh, sounds pretty messy and we don't want any extra stickage to the Dutch oven. So just a quick note here. Hey guys, so I have the ingredients for the apple dump cake. It is two cans of apple pie filling, one can or one box of uh, cake mix. You can do yellow or white and then one can of Sprite or Serum Mist or whatever. That's it? That's three ingredients, that's all. Oh, that's pretty simple. All right, so what's the first process? Uh, we're gonna mix the can of Sprite with the cake mix. Okay. Kristen mixing up the cake mix and that just mixes up right with the Sprite. Yeah, you don't have to do anything that the box has on there, just the Sprite. And then what do we do with it? We're gonna put it on top of the apples. We'll put the two cans of apples on the bottom and then okay. we'll put this on top. And All we'll right. put charcoals on top. How long will it cook for then? Uh, 30 minutes you check it and then they, they cooked it till about 40 so 30 to 40 I guess. All right so let's mix it up. Bubbly. Pretty, pretty simple pretty simple dessert here. It's all fizz in there. Fizzy fizzy. Looks like you're making a bomb. <laughs> a volcano. Oh yeah, mm. Volk root beer float. So I'll just mix this here, let the bubbles get down. They said it would be bubbly. The recipe said it was going to be bubbly? Mm-hmm. Okay. Just mix it till it's nice and mixed. I'm going to go slow so I don't mess up here. All right. Until I get Putting the apples in. The tin foil lined Dutch oven right now. How many servings is this? It says eight to 10, so it should be just enough for you. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I love sweets. In goes the cake mix, mix in with the Sprite. All right. Then we'll let it go for about 30 minutes and see how it looks. Okay, while we're waiting for the cake to cook up there, we're gonna kind of go over some of our Etsy items uh, a little bit more detail before we get them posted up. This isn't everything that we got, but just kind of shows you a little bit more what we got going on here. Kristen's gonna run through it. Okay, I made scarves. They're infinity armament scarves. The wrap around toy. Got some of those. I crochet beanies, different kinds of beanies. Oh, 
awesome. Uh, we got some of Isaac Tamales here. We got a lot of them here. out of different kinds of beads. They wrap around kind of like this one here on my wrist. I make purses. Kind of sew them. Do a little bit of the hemp straps. We also got tie-dye t-shirts. We just didn't bring any with because we got a lot of them. tapestries, other independent crystals and stuff that we pick up at gem shows and stuff. So yeah, just a quick rundown. We're going to be taking pictures of them tomorrow. I'm going to do a fishing video and Chris is going to kind of run through the inventory. We're going to get them all posted up on Etsy. I'm going to take pictures of them all and kind of set them up kind of nice to put them up there. But yeah, we had some several people um, of our viewers asking about it. So i to give you a little bit more detail. Um, by the end of the week, we should have it all up for you. So we'll get back to the cake here once it's all done. Okay, everyone. We are about 35 minutes in. Looks about done here. We put the fork in it. it looked good. So Kristen's going to scoop her up there. Once again, this is just cake mix, Sprite, and apples. Looks good, looks like oh, the cake, well cake mix has got a little bit of sprinkles in there. Wow, that's a heaping, <laughs> heaping portion right there. Looks good. So we'll let it cool down here a little bit and then we'll give it a taste. Okay, everyone. We uh, let it cool down and it is really good. Cake came out perfect and the apples are just as good as any apple pie, warm hot apple pie that you would have. So this is a very good uh, little dessert, really easy to make. And uh, if you're ever uh, wondering or wanting to do it, I would suggest to do it because uh, it's pretty good. But thank you guys for watching and we'll be posting another video here in the next couple days. Talk to you later. Bye. Enjoy.